Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Could be at my door at this hour. Oh, hey, it's you, little feather. Come in, come in. Oh, yeah, you know. I've just been, uh, well, vibing. Yeah, I don't know. Today seems like one of them off days, you know? Yeah. A lot of people go through these types of days where they're just not feeling the greatest, nor the hottest. And for me, it's one of those days. I'm just not feeling in top shape, you know? Nah, that's nothing you could do. It's something I gotta do with myself. I gotta prep myself up. I gotta make sure that I'm all mentally up there. But it's difficult. Especially when I have all these eyes on me. <sighs> Little feather. Can I talk to you? Not just as a hero, nor a teacher, but a human. You see, I, I like being a hero. I really do. Helping out others, seeing all my great fans and whatnot. But they don't really pay attention to the other side of my life. The part of life where I have to uh, keep sheltered in my personal life. All they see is the flashy hero. But in reality, it's getting hard. Mm-hmm. Hard to, uh, keep that smile on my face sometimes. But, I fight through it. Because I know just being sad all the time doesn't really help out with the mental. <laughs> I'm glad you ch checked up on me. I really am. I was getting kind of to the point where I'm, well, I cry a little. There's not a lot of people I could tell that in this world. But I trust you. So, I'm being vulnerable. And I know it's, it's okay to be vulnerable. Trust me, I know. But other times, it's not okay. You gotta hold back those emotions. Because there's other people that are in need. But you can't please everybody. <laughs> I messed up, little feather. I promise to be a hero and protect people. But back there, when I was dealing with a villain, I had no other choice but to kill him. I, I didn't want to do it. I really didn't want to do it. But they left me no choice. 
I could tell that they were a good person. They just wanted to protect their friends. Sadly, he was led down the wrong path. And that ended him... Well, it ended him. I tried talking to him before he up and attacked me. He could have been a great hero, but sadly he was too far gone. And I know I couldn't do anything about that, but I wish I could. I wish I could just change their minds to become a hero. Great people like that shouldn't be turning to a life of villainy. <sighs> I wish I could do more. I wish I could do a lot more to help out those who are in need. Sometimes, you can't do that. Thank you. Really, thank you. For being here with me. For making sure I'm okay. A lot of the pro heroes don't really check up on me because they think I'm just this loose cannon. So I appreciate you coming by. I love you too, little feather. And trust me when I say that, I do mean it. Because, quite frankly, you might be the only person that actually gives a shit. <laughs> Say, why don't you just, uh, call in tonight? I'll say you're working with me. But, I have some ideas for you and I. You see, I got this new, uh, uh, strain from Saro. Yeah, he's been working hard in his own medicinals and whatnot. And, uh, he gave me this strain to test out. So, I was wondering if you want to just hang out with me, test it out, watch a few movies, get something to eat, like takeout or something. Great. I was hoping you would say yes. Alright. Well, that... Got my spirits a little bit more higher. <laughs> I do very much appreciate you. Just for being my friend, honestly. I don't have much friends now. But you? You're one of the good ones, little feather. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, what have you been up to, though? I've been, well, keeping an eye on you, after all. I'm helping you with your hero work. Training you and whatnot. But, handing you off to Endeavor, I can't really pay attention. So, what have you been learning? Oh, I see. So, he's been training your quirk a lot as of recently. Well, that's good. Close combat? <laughs> fighting that hothead as a sparring partner. It's like fighting a silverback gorilla. <laughs> well, I'm proud of you for getting better at it. I mean, you got two of the best heroes treating you. Yeah. 
Well, I mean for your next training segments that are not, like, for a few more days, with me at least. I think I'm going to be teaching you about more, uh, speed and whatnot. Because, uh, you're more of, uh, in a lighter weight class than most heroes. So I want to use your lighter weight to your advantage. I want you to be more fast, more agile. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, you can use my bathroom. Yeah, I don't mind. Just make sure not to touch any of my uh, soaps and whatnot. I gotta keep my hair and stuff right. <laughs> Alright, I'll be out here waiting for you. <laughs>